So, I did a little looking into the, uh, some of the, like that nuclear uh, power plant. Yeah, it does not require extra, you know, I don't have to keep filling it in, you know, that stuff. Uh, uranium. Yeah. Could not tell. So, yeah, no. Nothing to worry about. I uh, didn't check to see how much heat it gives out, but it won't be. If it does start to give out a crap ton of heat, it won't be too hard just to set up a. Yeah. <gasps> Event. Yeah. I gotta. I gotta get help or something, you know, about that. It is definitely a bit of a problem. Also, I'm setting this to only have uh, marble because that's what we're using a lot of. Yeah. Alright, as soon as you finish using, using that, we'll uh, get rid of it. Or not get rid of it, just let you. So I'm gonna use this area as a storage for the, you know, body parts. Not to mention uh, some of the drugs and medicine we have. You know, stuff that doesn't decompose. Also decided to uh, get a better bed. I thought it was time that I got something a little more. Yeah. Also, we have the crematorium, and we are working on those androids. Then afterwards, I'm actually thinking I want to get the autonomous mining. Because it can extract minerals and rocks from deep underground, and... I also did some looking into that. It doesn't use up a lot. Okay, it uses up like 300 power. That is a decent amount, but it's not too much. And I think it'd be worth consolidating some stuff in order to let it run but for now I think we're kinda good you know what you can do that I will work on this also working on the advanced components that we need oh and in a final thing I have decided we are moving into bat into uh, Cassandra Classic. While she is giving us time between disasters, it's kind of leading to a bit of a boring game. I I think it's just much better to have Cassandra and to sort of escalate things. I might move to Lovecraft if once we start going into more. Eldritch Horrors, but we're kind of not focusing on that in this adventure. We're going to use some of the Eldritch Horrors because it's part of the genetic craft, but really, we're not making a cult. But I'm really making a cult. Getting power fluctuations. I don't really quite know what's going on there. Anyway, we'll cremate a body into fertilizer. Oh, oh. Not the animal corpses or the monster's corpses. But impossible to harvest. Then we can get rid of these bodies that are just cluttering this area. Hmm. Oh! Right. There we go.
Also, also, I took a look at what the arc furnace does. It doesn't let you make new steel. It, it basically acts as a, as a more powerful electric smelter. Well, sort of. Like, you get the smelt weapon and metal from slag, but I, you don't have these. I, you, you can't get these or this stuff. But you also have the recipe to make high-grade steel, which I'm presuming you need for, well, other stuff. Switch these off. <sighs> Still been raining today. Not a thunderstorm, but yeah, a bit of a storm. So I just move all that other stuff out of there. I think it just makes the most sense. And as my little juvenile uh, muffler rat. Yeah, they do look pretty cool. Big tail and the hump and all that. Should get us some uh, milk and uh, wool any day now. Hopefully. I'm building up more steel because we can make that. Yeah, I think we're gonna suspend work on that for now. Let's work on autonomous mining. Starting to look lovely. I'm a good boss, aren't I? I'm actually giving you nice housing. It's heated. There's actually a nice tile floor made of marble. Friggin' marble. Working on cool new pants. Made of caribou leather. Okay, that's kind of a weird material, but wh whatever. The point is that, yeah, I am the leader for a reason. Because I'm the smartest. You guys can't seem to stack any of this stuff. Start moving stuff around. Hmm. 
Okay, as much as I like you doing your cleaning, we need to focus on hauling. Well, I guess mm, I'll do the research. Okay, so we have enough for an advanced geothermal generator. You know, I'm thinking we should do that. So once we get to like, ooh, let's see, how much does it cost to make a regular? You need 400, and we don't. We're not going to get much as much back. So if we get to like 200, I think, yeah, that should be enough. Let's uh, remove some of this area. I'm just gonna force you to do it. If you guys aren't gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. And what the? Oh, this is actual concrete, not just, huh. Okay, so when we're making concrete, huh, it's literally concrete. Oh, they even changed the recipe to you actually need concrete. Okay, all right, all right, that's fair. But, still need, oh. I didn't want to have to do this, but I had to. What I wouldn't give for a mechanoid invasion right now. Mm-hmm. Yeah, of course. Of course it's a poor one. <sighs> Squirrels out here. What about squirrels? What we're getting is just rodent DNA. Ugh. Ridiculous. Okay. 
Okay. At least we're now salvaging some apparel. Hmm. Hmm. This is not bad. Well, it's only good for blunt. Sells relatively well. Got the ultimate knife. Like, what the fuck? Well, hunting time again. You're just maintaining it. I thought you were actually... I'm like, wait, I don't remember giving you crafting, and I don't think you're that intelligent. We got harpy feathers. We got squid leather. You have some pretty decent material. Hmm. Something I can use. I want to fuse other stuff. Oh, thank you. Right. We can strip this. We don't have to worry about. Build the new one. We don't worry about power. Oh, we got 300. Okay, so I could have just done that pretty earlier. But, you know, better safe than sorry. Advanced geothermal. Start working. Because we are running out of power really quickly. you extract more of that squirrel DNA oh now we have hair DNA hair today gone tomorrow hmm You poor rabbit, you are in a bad spot. You're in a bad place. Oh, 
Okay, good work hauling all that around. Alright, how about you start tidying up some of the stuff? Something. I need a... I need... I need... I need something to happen! I need to kick some ass! It's got me talking like this and I don't know why. Yeah, we're still not going to use that, so we don't need to do that yet. Yeah, look at that. Advanced Geothermal Jenny. So we are good for power for a while. The downside is we're not good for components. Hmm. Alright, so my hope is, is that the auto drill will get us the more of the material we need. It's random, but it's consistent. So to speak. Like, it will keep drilling, even if, you know, no one else is. Once you finish the construction work around there, we can finish the work around here. Uh, okay. you go to, down the other way, you idiot. <sighs> Alright, what's done, done right, you better do it yourself. We're getting a raid. I bet it's gonna be a raid. Like the game wanted me to do some wanted something exciting. So then they decide to send a raid right as they get pissed off. I just that's what I'm calling. Oh god, yes! <laughs> I called it! I freaking called it! Alright, animals, stay inside. Everyone else? Let's go give them a warm welcome, shall we? Alright, we're still working on those. 
Oh, don't worry, it'll be fine. Not a good day! Not a good day for you. Get rid of those embrasures. Because they're using them for cover. turrets take care of it and yep we're good we took a few hits but we're fine huh I will strip you of your gear yeah oh. ah I see they were wrecking the uh, stuff I was working on yeah What other... Okay, uh, you know a bit of medicine and... Yeah, you're gonna need to start doing some, uh, healing people. Yeah, we definitely took a few bad hits. Okay, uh... Who is the most in danger? Yeah, Lions is the one who is in the most danger. Okay, so this time I'm going to... Yeah, I'm going to get rid of these embrasures. The ones around here are fine. that we can sell. Or er, not sell, salvage. Okay, anyone else in... Alright. You don't have any broken parts. You have a minor coolant loss. Other than that, you guys are fine. And Lion should pull through. Uh, anyone else who is a doctor? Self tend to yourself and then try and heal others. Same with you. Next, uh, yeah, we're definitely gonna fix that. Well, we got a few more items that we can salvage. I suppose that's fine, but, and dandy, but, yeah. Just 
gonna... There you go. Ah, goody. Oh, he has to be fixed. <sighs> Goddamn rats. Sorry, but you need to do more tending. Nobody feeding me. Feed me. Feed me. I said, Feed me. I'm a mean grandmother from out of ways, and I'm mean. Yeah. Okay. Okay, now we have a problem. That coolant loss. Yeah, you don't have an infection. You're, you're fine. The only people at risk of an infection are me and her. How about you? Yeah, tend to yourself. Ugh. Talk about bad timing. But hey, I wanted a little bit of excitement. I really did. And I got my wish. No, you're feeding me. You feed me. Yeah, I die, this whole series is over, and therefore your existence poops out. I'm like Azathoth. I, I wake up, this dream is over. too good. I get it. You think I'm happy? I'm not. I've just been in a world of pain. Just like you guys. You aren't the only one who's having problems. Holy shit. Okay, we better set this up. We gotta set these up so you can rest and you can get yourself fixed. Shut up before. 
before all this happened, but hey, what you gonna do? up all the damages with herbal meds apparently. something a little better, like... Hmm... Three bursts of seven. That's like 21 damage. And a slightly better fire rate. So you know what? I think the carbine's a better choice. I mean, the bow is cool, though. Won't lie. Yeah. Go ahead and rest. I need you fixed up as well. And it was at this point, Bren realized he fucked up. How did I fuck up? I got cocky. That's how I fucked up. Get cocky, that's what happens. inside with our animals safely inside I know there's some stuff out here but yeah there's also stuff out there that want me dead yeah and we're all wounded so that's this is great oh and we have a thrumbo two thrumbos that we probably won't be able to tame because we're so injured and then those dark young are gonna be out there well if I'm lucky maybe the dark young will target the thrumbo <laughs> I want to see that like I know you know my previous thing I sort of forced a fight between them but I'm kinda curious about you know if they'll do it intentionally like will they hunt them? Or will they just only go for things that are, you know, weaker than it? Will it get so, will they get so desperately hungry that they'll go for a Thurumbo? Or just starve? I don't know. Either way, we're not getting him. Um, we're, we're probably not going to get him because, yeah. Alright, order expand areas. 
take the left side, so the outside, because we do need to continue the construction of this. Young dark one, only a hundred years old. Yeah, just just a hundred. Yeah, that seems pretty young. Relief bar. This thing should calm you down a bit. some of the pain in make you feel a little better and now we're having the problem of the idling because of the damages we all took oh okay now we're gonna stay inside Outside has gotten a little more hostile. Because there's only one thing. There's only. It's either they're gonna leave because there's no food, or they're gonna starve. These things get hungry really fast. They need to eat. They might actually go for the Thrumbos. I would love to see that. in my little safe space so we're all healed up Fire is coming! <laughs> you know, I wanted some excitement, but this is starting to get a little ridiculous. I don't know where it's gonna come from. Where it's gonna come in. Yep. I think the turrets do have the ability to notice them. I'm not too sure. That's what's scary. Oh my god! 
Dark Young versus Star Vampire. Oh my god, look! It, it's hunting it! Oh, and it's wrecking my turret. Fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, and it took out the obelisk? Ah. Oh. No, no, please don't. Stop wrecking it. Please stop. Um. This is riveting. I'll blow the dark young. So, how did it get wounded? Zipper shaped maw. Yeah, I think. Yeah, I think it's attacking both my turret and it. Either way, we're gonna have to rebuild these. Fuck. Well, I have been meaning to get. set up a new embrasure. You know, marble will be much stronger. Maybe even go into Bonecrete. Hey, you know what? I'm happy. I'm happy that they're... Yeah. Oh my god, and the Dark Young has lost. And now I'm scared. Because I don't know where the star vampire is. I don't know if it's going to bleed out and die. Or what. Either way, I'm staying inside. I'm not going out until I can confirm where it is. Okay, it is still out here. Young's dead. Oh, jeez. Where's the... Okay, where's the last Dark Young? It's going for the Star Vampire. Oh! So I have an idea where it is. I just don't know... Yeah. Well, at least it's cold out here, so it's not going to spoil as quickly. Oh god, I am afraid for my life. I am afraid for my life, ladies and gentlemen. I truly am. Let's just, let's not even kid ourselves, let's just set up the whole thing as marble. The inside's fine, but the outside, yeah. 
Oh god, it's still out here, isn't it? Well, it, it's dead. It, it's go. It's gotta go. It's gotta die of, of starvation eventually. I mean, and it's been. It's taken a lot of wounds. It had to have. It's because, you know, the robots. Well, I'm sorry. Although, I'm gonna stay out here in case you decide to wander in, you know, outside. Because you might just ignore everything. That's what scares me. I am afraid for my life because we are dealing with a monster and I don't want to open the door. Well, if actually, if I remove the roof area here, I can make this like a... This would technically be considered outside, so you could step out of here to get at least a little bit of cabin fever reduced. There's just something about the whenever the droids can't work, it screws with my, you know, with everything else. I don't know why. are still here and not being killed. What, the Star Vampire doesn't like th the taste of the rumbo? Okay, I am being fucking serious. I can't tell if it's dead or not. eventually starve, right? That's why it came! Because it's hungry! I am completely freaking out, man. So it's am like totally freaking out, man! healed. 
You're fully healed. So all that's left is you, and then I think everything will get back into operation. Okay. Alright, you know what? I gotta do it. I have to step outside. Okay, we have the legendary knife of Stabbington. Okay, well, when he opens the door. Ah! Die! 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 Oh my god, I was right. It could fuck up a star vampire. How are you feeling? Huh? Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, we're alive! Okay, everybody, you are unrestricted. Animals, you are unrestricted. Wait, oh, we fine? Yeah, we're fine. Okay. Uh. Give me a heart attack, why don't you? Okay, we need to set up for security. No, a new turret. Not like that. Uh, like that. Then set up a shredder turret. Okay. <sighs> We are out of marble. All right, you know what? I'll I'll set up some marble. Ugh. All right, uh You seriously can't... Why will you not try and tame it? There you go. Seriously, you gotta give it a... You gotta give it a shot. Before, you know, it die. You know, it leaves. Or it hits one of my traps and dies. Though, if it does get injured... You know, we could try, you know, going with that route. Okay, now you're giving it, you're attempting it. And I think, yeah, it's leaving. So you only have one shot at this. Oh. Oh, it left. Oh. We're not gonna mind that for now. There's stuff we need to mine, and right now, that's not one of them. So that was... Okay, I'm not gonna lie, that was pretty cool. Star Vampire versus Dark Young. Yeah, well, alright, that was pretty cool.
You need to do some maintenance. Maintenance that needs to be done. Why is nobody maintaining some of this stuff? survived all that. I really can't. I'm still a little freaked out at the moment. I really am. I just... <sighs> we still... We don't even have all our defenses back up. Like, we lost our turrets. Well, actually... Yeah, we have one in there. This one we will also set up. This one we can cancel. carrying it over to get its vile genes. That was incredibly stressful. It really was. At least you got you salvaging the peril. Build a roof area here. I'm gonna take a small breather. I'll see you next time. <laughs>